Hey, what's up guys? This is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Sakucha here. And we've got an unboxing. Y'all know what that is. Yeah. We're gonna see what we got in there. I know we needed a bunch of this for some of the spooling that we needed to get done. And I need to find my knives. I don't know what the hell I did with them. But I lost two. They're somewhere. I'll find them. It's just getting annoying that I haven't been able to find them recently so oh yeah we got black 100 pound hollow core that is awesome I'm glad he sent that sweet so we got that we've got 80 pound in orange we ran out of that last week so we got 65 pound test in the chartreuse I do have to say that it looks a little brighter than what it normally is. Let's see. Oh, what are your thoughts? I think it looks a little brighter. Hmm. I don't know. Just we'll see. And then we've got 65 and orange right there. Sweet few of the spools that we ran out with, but this is what we got to do. We got to spool these two up. So, yeah, let's get to it. Get to it. Gotta fight. Gotta fight. I think I got a, got a lot of stress on my mind. It's a nice day to go. Yeah, I got a line. I'm a caller. The whole team. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put on some backing of 65 and red just so that way if they're ever getting spooled down they, they know how much line they're down to and that'll be you know, like the first 50 yards and it's, it's got a good good idea to it of, of giving our customers the ability to know if they are ever hooked up on a monster fish how much line that they're working with between their top shot and uh, their main fighting line and then now too all the way down to their backing there all the way down all right guys so what i'm tying here is i'm doing a holocore splice on the braid itself to anchor the braid to the spool right here we call it our anaconda knot and we are going to make it tied down and cinch down on the arbor so that way the braid does not slip and we do not use any tape or any monofilament as you have seen multiple times where the mono has failed because it wasn't tied properly and even stretches. Are you going to record the ghost hunters when they go by? There we go. 50 yards of 65 and red. Now we're going to go to 65 and chartreuse. Let's make sure I'm on the right side. Nope, wrong side. There we go. I'm 
うんそううんそれは So we're up to 250 yards of 65. Now we're going to top shot it with 80 pounds. Alright guys, we're at 285 yards of braid on this reel. I'm gonna go and fill up the other one. We'll see how it goes. Just waiting on the one part to come in.
286 yards with plenty of room for casting. Doubled up on them. Very nice.